What's up everyone on YouTube, Main Man Sui here, hoping you're all doing awesome as always, and I'm about to watch another tool assist speedrun super video by Mina Highway. Well, it's not going to be a speedrun, but it's going to be prototype Jack versus Jack 2. I had a viewer who wanted me to watch this because I don't know if you guys have seen my video on prototype Jack, I made a Tekken revisited video on him in Taiwan and how he is the pound for pound worst Tekken character of all time. And he told me that in this video, Mina Highway is going to play around some of the stuff I showed in that video. I have no idea if, if that's accurate, but either way, this guy always does amazing videos. However, what the fuck? Oh, wait, I have a bug. Um, let's see. We're going to have to do that. Here we go. I hope the audio isn't too loud. The, uh, the Jack combos in Tag 1 are, are super interesting, by the way. And uh, so, again, Jack 2. That was sick. What a punish. <laughs> so, Jack 2 is a terrible character in Tag 1. He's really bad. But the character you're seeing there in all shiny, metal, you know, glowy, aluminum, adamantium, prototype Jack, that's the worst Tekken character ever. No one is worse than him. No one. But of course, he's gonna make him look like an absolute god now. You see those combos? Trust me, he's terrible. Yeah, I mean, Gigas would beat the shit out of P-Jack. Easily. <laughs> Oof, that's a combo. Gigas is a god compared to P-Jack. It's, it's not even a contest. Not even close. Eesh! That launch... Jesus, the combos. What the fuck? <laughs> that was sick. What the... I, I, I've never seen these combos before. But okay, it's tool assisted, but still, like, creativity goes into uh, finding this stuff. That was guaranteed. Oh shit! Oh god, I I, I want to play Jack. J Why did they remove that throw? It's the best throw of all time. Hey, Hachi could also do that on Lee. Spank his ass. Uh, if you played uh, Lee and Hey Hachi in a team, that would be their intro. Hey Hachi would spank his ass. Oh no, P-Jack, our hero, the underdog, he, he's not in the lead. That works? And you're dead. One, two, three, four. Okay, P-Jack needs another two rounds. But he, he's great in the clutch. I love these jack combos. Oh no. What a whiff punish. <laughs> oh, ju just frame block. Nice. Very nice.
This combo is so cool. Oh god. No follow up? Doesn't he get the hammer? P Jack! Oh no! Don't tell me Jack wins! The underdog of all underdogs. <laughs> Oh, that was sick. Eesh. You are terminated. It kind of looks like Arnold though in Terminator 2. Or maybe Terminator 1. Oh, Gunjack. But there are a couple of things I want to mention. In Tag 1, you can do really weird combos. If you, and he's doing it all the time. When you launch someone from the side, they can't tech roll. And then you can actually hit them. You can just keep picking them up until they are super far away. You can do insane combos this way. And that's the last game where you could abuse that shit. Tekken 3 in this game. And then, uh, yeah, P-Jack is terrible. Uh, unfortunately, he looked like a complete god because it's a tool assist video. But uh, yeah, P Jack is complete shit. He can't poke, he can't combo, he can't. Well, with tool assist, he. It looks like you can't combo with P Jack with tool assist. Ooh. A gun jack, this is a boss battle. Oh. No wonder Gun Jack is the Jack they uh, they kept as a mainstay for the main series. He's just absolutely the best Jack. I mean, he can he can shoot. It's a, it's a very creative name. He has weapons. He has a gun. Oh, who is he? Oh, he's Gun Jack. Mm, makes sense though. Makes sense. Mmm, whiff punish. Oh, tombstone. And uh, the characters in Tech and Tag 1 actually have uh, varied uh, or individual uh, amounts of health. Uh, Ancient Ogre and Ogre have the most health in the game. Xiaoyu and Wang, I think, have the lowest amount of health. And Jax have quite a bit of health. But it never helped them because most characters get twice as long combos on, on the Jax. So even with that extra health, you just got obliterated every time you got launched by a Mishima, basically. Uh, everyone played Mishimas, basically. That's a fucking tombstone. Oh, backbreaker! What would I break first? Your spirit or your body? <laughs> oh. Hey, P Jack's still in the game. I hope he wins this. Oh, counter it. That's gonna launch. You saw how he did 2-1 uh, there, and it whiffed. God, I don't know if I can find it. You saw how- you see how he does 2-1? It doesn't have a hitbox almost, uh, the 2, and then the 1, the elbow, is almost impossible to connect on anyone. And that string, you know, which Jack uses as a punish these days, 2-1, for his, uh, is that 12 or 11? It's 11, right? Uh, that string doesn't work in Tag 1. 
the string is there to one, but if you if you hit the punch, the one whips. So it's like, they, they, didn't anyone bother to actually test the strings that they worked? Most likely not. Uh, tag 1 was quite the rush job from, from what I've heard. Uh, nice. Oh shit, god damn it. No one likes Gunjack. Oof! Damn, the da look at the damage. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no, punish. I think it's gonna go down to one health on both our contestants. Why did he go for the exact same finisher when he knew that Gunjack was watching his, uh, his streamed fight versus Jack 2? But th th is he doing down 1 plus 2 from crouching? He's crouching into it, isn't he? Oh, he, he did a, a one frame fast uh, crouch cancel. Yeah, it's a uh, fucking tool assist, yeah. Uh, but beautiful video as always by Mina Highway. And so cool that he gives uh, sh some spotlight to the Jax in Tag 1. Uh, basically character no one ever saw. Uh, I mean Tekken 3, Jack, no. Tag 1 very popular for a long time more popular than Tekken 4 but um if you if you only look at like the, the competitive scene people were playing tag rather than Tekken 4 but no one ever used the jacks and uh, they were complete garbage it's well it's nothing you you see here because they look absolutely godlike but it's um it's just comical how how god tier the Mishimas were in this game and how unbelievably bad uh, the jacks were. It's almost like in uh, in terms of balancing in... Um, oh god, that haircut. Oh, I did myself a big favor there. There's a dead squirrel there. Or is it a cockroach? Uh, sorry, I'm, I'm just gonna do a presenter hair. Okay, there we go. That, that's okay. Uh, but God, I'm so superficial in um, in tag one. No, wait. Well, what was I saying? I was so focused on my hair as always. Uh, brain fart. I'm so old. 34. <laughs> Alzheimer's is setting in. Uh, oh, 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 I got it. In, in Tekken 7, uh, if you have the best character here and the worst character here, let's say Gigas, Eliza, probably Gigas. And then at best character, we probably have Geese or Akuma or wh whatever character you want to put there. This is the level between them. This is the worst character and this is the best character. If you would do the same for Tag 1, Mishimas versus Prototype Jack, Prototype Jack would be here and Mishimas would be here. That's how unbalanced Tag 1 was in comparison. But to be honest, it would probably be even wider. It, it would be... This is the difference between um, Gigas and Geese. And yeah, this is the difference between Prototype Jack and, um, and Roger Jr., the kangaroo. Uh, but great video by Mina, as always. Uh, I certainly enjoyed that. Hope you enjoyed my commentary a little bit, at least. Uh, take care, everyone on YouTube. Have a nice day.